We are MiniWiz Sustainable Energy Development Company, and I'm going to introduce to you our latest technology. It's a disruptive technology in green building materials. It's called the Polybrick. It's made of recycled PET plastic, the type of plastic that holds this water bottle right here. Now, most of these bottles are thrown away. Most bottles that are thrown away, you know what happens to them? You know what happens to these bottles? They get burned. When they don't get burned, they end up in landfills, they end up floating in the oceans. That's not very good. We can build permanent structures out of these bottles. We recycle them, we do some patented magic to them to make them very, very strong. You can build a bridge out of these and drive trucks and tanks across it. That's because of the octagonal shape and what we do to the plastic. It's UV treated and uh, it can withstand hurricane force winds and earthquakes. We've done all the testing. It also has a tremendously high R value. There's eight liters of air in the real size of our poly brick. And that means if it's hot outside, you're not going to be hot inside. If it's cold outside, you're not going to be cold inside. And it's translucent. So we can build a convention hall just like this out of the poly brick, and we won't be using as much electricity because you're getting the power of the sun giving you lighting during the day, and you're getting the R value in the insulation keeping you, in this case, warmer than we are right now. We should be a little bit warmer in a building like this, but we're not. At night, we embed LED technology, and behind me, you can see what a real installation looks like. The power of the sun is collected during the day, and it runs the LEDs at night. If you want to, your entire structure can glow. If you want to, all of the power that you collect is going to light the inside of your building once the sun goes down. That's the polybrick. It costs less than one-third of competing systems. In fact, compared to stone, less than one-fourth of what it would cost to put stone on the outside of your building, glass, less than one-fourth, uh, it's ridiculously low, ex low cost. And because it doesn't weigh much, the dead load weight is so low, you can open up your structure and you have a lot more capabilities as an architect. Yes, you can put windows in a poly brick structure. I'll be happy to give you the images. Uh, they're also online of all the different structures that we're making in Asia. The government of Singapore has commissioned a poly brick building. Taiwan is going to have the very first in the world poly brick building. Uh, there's also going to be two structures in China. One that has this technology all on the inside of a 36-story building being built right now. And there's going to be another building with poly brick all on the outside. So uh, it's our latest addition to recycled materials. Everything we make, whether it's consumer facing, like our high mini product that's rather famous, or uh, disruptive green building materials, it's all recycled. And the message is that you don't have to wait for someone else to change society so you can live a renewable life. You can do it yourself. You can charge up your personal devices with the power of the sun, power of the wind. You can live in structures that are recycled themselves with a very low carbon footprint that will last forever. And uh, you don't have to wait for somebody else to tell you to do it because it doesn't cost much. And you don't have to look like you're living in a cave. It can be beautiful, just like the structures that we're building in Asia.